Hello, hello, welcome back. My name is Mary, and if you're new here, my name is still Mary. <laughs> so today I will be watching The Expanse episode 2, and I just watched episode 1, and I really enjoyed it so far. I feel like we're gonna have a really good backstory throughout the whole show where you have Earth and Mars and the Belters and all of that. And in front of that you have the characters that I feel like they're gonna work with a lot because we immediately saw Holden having this connection, making a judgment call, making, you could say the wrong judgment call, but everything is easy to say in hindsight, of course. And then Miller, the whole thing with him having to look for Julie. If I'm thinking now, he was looking for Julie. Julie was a voice coming from a transmitter that actually was a bait from Mars. Interesting stuff. So I'm here for it. I really liked what I've seen so far and I'm very curious to just dive in deeper. If you like it, make sure to like and subscribe. The full reactions and edited reactions are two weeks ahead on Patreon. So if you cannot wait for the next ones, go oh, make sure to check out Patreon. All right, let's go. crucial part of the formula. Neutralizes acidity, adds body, balances pH, something like that. Wait, so now we're gonna see them bond more, knowing that she died. Hey, what's your name? Ade. Jim. He's dreaming. There's something you should know. Boss. Yeah, that would mess me up. Debris field, buckle up. Also, they don't have a big ship to go back to, right? Right, sweetheart. You know how much I love you. Oof. Oh, that was too close for comfort. Oh no. Damn, like you just had that major loss and immediately need to be back on point because there's just new trouble. All right. So where did they go from here? They have nowhere to go except for Sirius immediately. Do not lose that ship. Jesus, you're not We're trying. going after them. What? They just dusted. 50 of our friends. Well, let's not make it 55. 50. What if they don't like being followed? Yeah. They'll get away with this. There's nothing you can do. What is wrong with you? I gave an order. You think rank matters now? Get up. I'll do it myself. I would say that rank matters the most, though, in situations of distress, but he's clearly just emotional. We're not going anywhere. Ooh. And she knows why they're here. I think it's admirable at this point she's not like screaming at him that it's because of you that we're in this mess. Wire ration exceeded. Wire ration exceeded. Well, that sucks. But also it's very clearly indicated, so it's not like it's a surprise. How did he get all the foam off <laughs> without water? Just dried himself up. They're trying to thirst us out. Who's that? Earth, Mars. The water shipment's not late, Copain. Copain? We're French? One shipment late, you got protests. Two shipments late, you got dead people in the street. And it's gonna get worse. Not very promising. Wouldn't people be also saving up their money if we can take a shower? They're like, I'm gonna skip a shower, but just catch all the water and keep it in my room. Father, father, what hot coffee in the parking lot. Interesting, old voice activated. Cool. Replay my last messages. My last messages. I tried to give you the best of all worlds. Is that her dad? You're naive, sweetheart. It's time to come home. Is that dad? Show me my replies. Show me my replies. If you want to take yourself seriously as an adult, then why should I care about being your child? You can't buy me off or control me anymore. Is the first thing that he said when he entered like a code to unlock that they can access all the files of everybody with the voice? <laughs> so much water. That's weird. You'll get there. 
I guess that maybe taking the water from her, if he would have a jug that he could fill, would be theft or something if it's so important there. It's more valuable than gold, they said. So. Is it true that you had a belter up on hooks? I still don't know where I know her from, though. I thought I was Game of Thrones, but I think I'm wrong. He That's didn't public. want the to Secretary talk. General has publicly disavowed gravity torture. If you want to talk to that belter, you put him in the tank. I need to know how you got your hands on restricted stealth technology that could destroy the balance in the system. You mean the balance between Earth and Mars? Earth has created a race of exiles out in space who have no homes to return to. Oof. I don't mean to make you afraid, madam. Have I given you the impression that I'm afraid? Then why waste your time on a meaningless courier like myself? It's interesting, like, why haven't you finished me off? Someone entrusted you to transport pieces of the Holy Grail. Who? There are places far worse than this. And I imagine there is a mother somewhere who would love to see her boy again. Oh. We all have our duty. It's interesting that they're also looking for the stealth technology, which is also what happened with them. What's wrong with the radio? Well, it's cooked, and I'm guessing the antenna array up top has seen bad days. I don't mean to be a bad news bull or anything, but uh, airlock's done. He's not going anywhere. And we'll have to vent the ship. We'll lose all oxygen in the cabin. Oh, God. I'm going outside. You got a problem with that? Amos, go with him. We open those doors, we're done. If we go out there, you can hear me. We're gonna die. I'm not ready to die. Hey, 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 hey. I feel like. I'd be him in a situation like this. Now we're gonna go outside. I wanna make some noise and get rescued. Okay. I do admire when people in a moment of stress can actually make others feel better. That you not just have the energy for yourself, but also for someone else. It can always be worse. Okay. It's worse. And it doesn't look good. Little sparks flying up. Well, it's about time. Oh. A week ago, those dead patches started appearing. My guess is the Grigus are stealing water again. Some belters clearly don't respect the green space's role in recycling the air and the water. Not to mention the embarrassment it causes the governor. Well. You seem sure it was belters. The criminals here tend to be. Whoa, he has some judgment ready. Maybe if everyone in series had this view, they'd respect it more. Hmm. He's a bit blind for the situation that everybody else is in. There. Now you can make your own view. Pretty dismissive. <laughs> Here, have a cactus. Okay. Oh, shit! Oh, no. Oh, it's like it's not bad enough already. Like those days that really suck and you up your toe against a corner of a table. <laughs> I don't even know where you're from. We're gonna be space trash in a few hours. And you wanna start a friendship? You don't think we're gonna make it? What are you doing up here? Naomi told me to. As far as I'm concerned, she's a cat now. Interesting. <laughs> What's he doing? Send me some juice to E12. Is he high? <laughs> you doing okay out there? I'm doing as good as do on a morning full of sunshine. Hey, what's the deal with you and Naomi? You two an item or something? An item? You must think I'm pretty stupid, don't you? I can take a core part, put it back together with my eyes closed. But ask me whether or not I should rip your helmet off and kick you off this bucket. And I can't give you a reason why I should or shouldn't. Oof. Except Naomi wouldn't like it. Maybe it's better to just work a bit in silence because I don't know. Alex, what are you doing? Oh, don't be like that, sugar. I said I'm coming home. He's, he's hypoxic. Oh, shit. His breather's crapping out. Oh my god, he's not getting oxygen? Oh no. We're losing him. No, not losing Alex. We're in a vacuum. He's in a suit. I... You're a medic. Act like one. Get your shit together and solve this issue, okay? I'm hooking our breathers up, okay, so we can share air, so you can breathe off mine, okay? Shed, what's happening? Oh, God. Hold on, Alex. Come on. There it is. Breathe. Breathe, Alex. Breathe it in. Breathe. Close call. 
we're buddy breathing. How long will oxygen last for two people? No one else dies today. We don't get that radio back. We all die. Today. Okay, Alex, my turn, buddy. I just need a couple breaths. <gasps> oh, I thought they would combine it. No, it's actually like, put it in yours, put it in mine. Put it in yours, put it in mine. And this is low. Get on with it. Hurry up. Yeah, thinking about it is not gonna work. Just think about something else, okay? Like your kid. Think about your kid. Swing on a... Swing on a swing or something. I was gonna say, or what? You're, swing on a swing? You're trying to distract me. Yes. <sighs> Which is nice. <laughs> oh god. Oh. I don't want to lose another one so quick. Now, I'm carry on. Ah, piece of shit. It's gonna help. <laughs> we have connection. <laughs> oh my god, it's like we're all TVs. <laughs> oh, we have signal. Get the air in. Oh no. Ale. Just wrote down his name and we add a little cross. A lot of crosses on my list. <gasps> He's alive! Okay, scratch out the cross again on <laughs> the roller coaster. What the hell did you do to me? You saved my heart, partner. <laughs> uh, no problem. That was too close. I need him sent to Luna for deeper interrogation. Let the team here go another round. They'll break him. This boy isn't some hapless smuggler. I believe the OPA may be trying to obtain stealth weapons. Everything is not an OPA plot. And if Earth can't afford a stealth program, how can a bunch of rock tossers? They can't, unless they have found a new friend like Mars. Which it seems like it is happening. And your belter will like gravity on Luna better. It's the only thing you like. I'm afraid for him. Heaven help your enemies, Christian. Heaven help us all if Morris and the Belt decide to share the toothbrush. Bold move. I'll give them that. The fact that she's admitting to be afraid. The cold war is over. This is something new. And she's super aware of what is going on, it seems. While everybody else is like, no way. So we just blew an hour of air for a radio that doesn't even work? It's better than not trying anything. Take everything apart. Be fast and be careful. We're inside a balloon with a pin here. If it has a battery, a power pack, any charge capability, it goes into a path. Just staring at her. I'm sorry, does anyone need a back rub first? Even if someone hears our SOS, they're gonna think we're pirates. We're just gonna have to pray there's another Karen soul out there like Ade. Oh! If she hadn't gone and logged that stupid distress call, right. I said, you don't know what you're talking about. You wanna keep your teeth in your mouth. We're wasting air. Damn, it's so shocking because they all blame her, but she has passed away. And, like, that's so sad. We have enough problems right now. But I agree with her. Like, just whatever about that right now, focus on the problem at hand. You know that guy was telling you to go hump yourself. Hump yourself? <laughs> I got plans for it anyway. Not even gonna ask. Nice tat. Boss, let you wear your colors like that out in the open. The boss has one just like it. Ooh. Did he just... I don't know. You gotta admire the stones for hitting the park. You say this pipe diverts too? 12 level condenser grid. It's in a warehouse. Even water like these today. Belt loader. Gonna want it. Savaka. It looks absolutely yuck. Sorry, Helix. Don't move! Ooh. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, hey, whoa, whoa. <sighs> Free sample. You know, you're lucky. It's us chasing you. And not the Grigas. Grigas are gone. Nobody just abandons their territory. A bunch of street punks. You see, the Grigas were smart. They siphon a little water and sell it off. It's you. You gutter punks. You screw the golden goose. <laughs> you should be better and smarter thieves. 
schooling me on gangsters, Kay? Yeah. yeah. Dirt bag school's in session. Listen, you can pick all the pockets you want. Roll drunks. But when you mess with the water, that's when you're going down. It's so interesting, right? Fighting over water. Uh oh. Get out of here. I did not see that coming. Me neither. Not this. You see that coming? Not necessary. <laughs> It's so different than when you have a show where they're selling drugs and stealing that from each other and reselling versus when it's about water. The prisoner, Heike Sabon, took his own life by avoiding the high gravity injections from his crash couch. It appears he broke free of his restraints during a critical phase of the ascent when he knew the guards would be receiving their own injections. I think, madam, he was making a statement. Speak frankly, please. Whoa. Earth's gravity. We used it to hurt him. He threw it back in our face. Hmm. What is going on, right? Oof. His top grade military stuff. Serial stamp on the main board. Martian Congressional Navy. Stealth ship. Why would they nuke a civilian ship without warning? Because they can. It's just scary. Because then there's no limits anymore and war is on. Good signal. We got three hours of juice. I guess all we gotta do now is pop a cold beer and wait to be rescued. Damn, that's dense, right? Waiting to see if you get saved or die. And also, if there's another ship out there that's like, yeah, we're not going to answer a help call because we're on our way and want to meet the deadline. It might be a trap, right? <laughs> <laughs> now, there's a girl I'm not going to forget anytime soon. Some dog jock was slobbering all over while she's prepping her ship out. That guy must have uh, mistaken her good manners for encouragement. Oh, yikes. He laid hands on her. God damn, she planted him in the deck. I don't know what that means, but I can imagine something. <laughs> Scopuli, dumpy old transport. No cargo, just this young lady and a few crew. You also don't know if they're in on it, right? If they were on their ship and then Mars took over and planted that transmitter and she was actually saying help us, but from being taken by people from Mars and not just within her own ship. Someone heard us. Yay! <laughs> Is that ship on route? Oh, for a second I was thinking they won't. It's almost 80,000 clicks. How long is that? It's gonna be a hell of a close shave. Let's just stop breathing for a while. What? What is it? A ship. It's Mars. Oh, well. The Donager. Flagship of the Martian Navy. Oh no! That sounds like it's the worst possible solution. And we just told them where we were. Oh. Is there no way that they just want to capture them and not nuke them? I have chills. Still with his cactus, like, can you not put it down somewhere, please? Hey. Hey. Oh, it's a gift. Okay. Golly, Miss Val. You sure can pick them. Seems like she has a lot of options on this futuristic dating app. I think a rich girl like her would have had that birthmark fixed. It's a birthmark her parents would have had it fixed. What are you even talking about? Oh, it's a badge of defiance against everything she's supposed to be. Oh, on her chin? Okay. Wow. Did she tell you that herself? You read people. Interesting how he assumes that. Has he been to something similar? No, someone similar? We get on that ship and chances are we're never coming out. What are you doing? Buying us insurance. My name is James Holden, speaking for the five survivors of the Canterbury. Our ship was destroyed answering a bogus SOS from a ship called the Scopuli. We recovered a false beacon and identified it as Martian naval technology. It was a trap. Are you we're insane? We're about to be taken aboard the MCR and done. Alex, shut him down. Just lock us out. Just lock us out. Shit, we're we're speak for us. We intend to cooperate in hopes this means we won't be harmed. Should I smoke him? <gasps> Any such action would only confirm that the Canterbury was destroyed by Mars. He's like, or you keep us alive, or everybody knows that you are doing bad stuff. The tension. It just needs to reach one ship, one station, then it'll spread. The jammers were in range. Oh, what? <laughs> and he probably knew all this time. 
Not just their jammers, it seems they were completely in range. Oh boy. Plop. Hey, they're not getting nuked yet. They could have already been dead, so that's great. You are prisoners of the Mars Congressional Republic. Move and you die. Oh, oh boy. These episodes go quick. Oh. Yeah, I don't know how to feel because in a sense, I'm like, if nobody would have shown up, you would have died anyway. If the radio wouldn't work, you would have died anyway. Air was almost finished, you would have died anyway. So in that sense, it's like, is this good? No, they're still alive, which is more than any other outcome would have been at this point. So when I finished the last episode, I was thinking that, oh, would Julie be part of the Mars thing? But now I'm more feeling that maybe they were picked up by people from Mars as well, and that she's actually a prisoner too, and not part of the whole thing, right? She went away on the ship and suddenly nobody's on that ship anymore and they did hear her say, help me. So yeah, it could be both ways still. She could be part of the bait, but I think she might actually be a prisoner and I think we want to figure that out maybe. If they are captured, maybe she's there as well. Who knows? Meanwhile, Miller is figuring it out. It's so interesting to see this quest on different sides where you have one person looking for her and then another just with one sentence we know that they're somewhere around her as well. I like that storyline a lot. It's interesting to see the tension about people of the crew thinking that Adi put them in this mess while he knows better and Naomi is not saying a word which I find very admirable because I can imagine that in a situation where everybody's stressed out, afraid of dying, like they're in hell right now and she's still like keeping this a secret and it's like you need to keep your shit together and not talk artists either so I find that very interesting oh i'm sad though i'm still sad that we lost ada and the other 49 people because i really liked the few short clips that we saw of her yeah i'm excited to figure this out oh, man i really want to binge the show already and i've already watched two episodes this is gonna be a problem in my schedule <laughs> all right i hope you enjoyed this reaction if you did make sure to like and subscribe full reactions as always you can find over on patreon together with edited versions and everything two weeks ahead so if you can't wait just as i can't you can already go and watch those on patreon i wish you a lovely rest of your day and i'll see you in the next one bye